Hello my friend. Thank you for coming back to my channel Moses TCG. If you watch this video up to the end, you learn how to how to upgrade your Windows 10 to Windows 11 without losing any data. And on my computer, I have these programs already installed. I have the folder here, new folder. I have uh, some files here. Uh, what my aim of the installation, I want to be sure that after the installation, I'll have my that I, I don't want to lose my data. Okay. Now what you do, you before you start, you need to download. Uh, uh, a Windows image from the Microsoft website okay uh, for me I've already downloaded it so I'm going to use it I'm going to get it from my flash from my flash drive uh, uh, what did I name it okay Win 11. Okay. Uh, you double click the program, uh, the, the image, the ISO image, and you double click on the setup. You select yes. You wait, it takes time to, to load. you uncheck this just to shorten the number of options you have to click uh, you click on change how to set up downloads if you don't check this if you don't check this the computer will take you to to, to download drivers and updates before you install and that will take a lot of time so we don't want that you just say we just select not right now and click on next the computer uh, the the setup will check your computer just to confirm if it is if it is meeting the minimum requirements for this upgrade so you have to wait for it to complete the checking You accept the the agreement license agreement uh, here I want to keep I want to keep my personal files okay I want to keep my personal files okay You wait.
Continuing with the installation of windows, we will change your display language. To change it back, you need OK. Select OK. Okay, it is just giving you the summary of what we are, you are going to do. If you had forgotten something, you, are, you can come back here and check uh, and change something. But for now, we don't need. We don't need to change anything. select install now it will take time to install for the purpose of making this video short I'm going to first pause it then I'll come back when everything is set When the installation is done, there are some few things you have to you have to to to, to change. Uh, what you need to do, you have to update uh, to, from the start menu. You you type update and you you update your windows just to the reason why we run updates just to to make sure that your computer is running with the current drivers drivers like for display for network for audio and so on okay another thing you might need to change something like for example do you see your taskbar here it is it look it looks like it is classic it is like in a classic mode so what you need to do is just to go to properties 
and double click actually you don't need even to double click here what you need to do you just go to colors you go to light and select custom then from custom from choose windows default mode you, you select you select duck and once you select duck your taskbar will change to black okay uh, our installation has made success has completed successfully as you remember i had some files here on the desktop and they are still there the only thing which has been removed is just the programs which i had uh, and uh, i have to install them but the, the documents all the documents are in their respective uh, directories like for example if i had desktops like documents on the desktop they are there if i had documents in the downloads they are there if i had documents in the um, my, in the documents folder they are there so basically the work is done successfully thank you for watching if you find this video helpful don't forget to subscribe and also share this video to your friends who might need to solve the same problem thank you 